Alrighty guys, welcome to Kingston And welcome back to the episode of Assassin's Creed 4 Black Flag We are back in uh, Back in Kingston, baby It's been a while since we've been here I kind of feel like I'm at home Let's go see what's going on We've got an objective over here I'm actually not even sure what we're doing at the moment So um, It'll be a surprise to both of us Such a long freaking way to go, my goodness. Oh. Where you at, treasure chest? I see you over there. Ooh, nice. Jade Satcher. Was that 4,000 reales that we just got for that? Did I read that right? I'm not even sure. Sequence 9. Imagine my surprise. What news are they? This barge on works for the Royal African Company. Tell him what you told me. I haven't seen the princess for eight weeks or more. Meaning she may soon be back. What else? I thought this buck belonged to the other men who was asking about the princess this morning. So I told him that... What other men? A potty sailor in plain rags and a gent with a scar just here. Where have they got to? That sounds familiar. Staying just round the corner, they said. grow tired of chasing these fantasies of yours, Edward. As does a crew. Hang in there, man. We're getting close. Locate Hornigold and Rogers. Come check it out. You know you want to. That was close. Alright, we've killed one out of four brutes. I want to sabotage both of the alarm bells as well. Wow, that was extra freaking super close. I don't think I've ever seen it that close before. Come at me, bro. For shame. What is this slave woman yelling? <laughs> Madman, for shame. Boo. <laughs> she was booing them. I don't know if she's booing them or booing me. It better be them, girl. She shouldn't be booing me. Jesus. I looked at from three directions. <laughs> Too bad it wasn't one direction. I'd love to kill them. <laughs> I get it. All right. We've killed two of four brutes. I want to sabotage this bell over here. I'm not sure when to be safe to go, though. to make sure this guy over here doesn't see us. And that guy. Cut it! Look at my sneaky self! Alright, let's tail these guys here. Have you alerted the I had a feeling this is going to prove to be time. pretty difficult. Right. There will be two soldiers waiting for us at the crossroads. Very good. If you don't mind me asking, sir, what's the meaning behind these blood samples we're taking? Torres tells me that blood is required for the observatory to properly function. How do you mean, sir? If one wishes to use the observatory to, say, spy on King George, then one would require a drop of the king's blood to do so. In other words, a small sample of blood gives us access to a man's everyday life. 
As close. I, Captain Hornigold, as will all Templars. It is a measure of insurance. And trust, I reckon. Yes, but fear not. Torres has shipped our samples to the Templar safe house in Rio de Janeiro. We will not be the observatory's first subjects. Precisely. Governor, when you hunted pirates in Madagascar, what methods worked best? I believe it was my charisma that persuaded you. Violence and threats should always be a last resort. In Madagascar, I offered those pirates a choice. Take a pardon and return to England penniless but free men, or be hanged by the neck until dead. Just as you did in Nassau. Precisely. A pity Commodore Chamberlain did not live to see my thorough success. <laughs> it's not like you to glow, Rogers. We all deserve a moment, don't we? That was really close. I don't know why he was coming after me, because I wasn't even in the restricted area. But I thought we were about to get caught, no doubt. I have no clue how they didn't see us there. And we were trying to run around the side of the building and kept running up it. Woo! That was lucky. Lucky, lucky, lucky. I am being like being on top of these buildings. I'm going to go ahead and get down. Makes me nervous. Hey, I'm a kid, these snipers, I don't want them to take me out. I am one sneaky bastard. was taken by pirates six weeks ago. So far as we know, the sage Roberts was still aboard. Very good. It is something, huh? And what measures are we taking to recover the princess from this fight? Captain Hornigold has dispatched some of his best men to ensure the sage is captured. What of the sage's present locations? You know? Africa, Your Excellency. Africa? By God. Which do you favor that? I concur, Grand Master. I should have sailed there myself. One of my slave galleys would be more than capable of making a swift journey. Slave galley? Nice! I ask you to divest yourself from that secret. I fail to see the difference between enslaving some men and all men. I must disappear the entire force of civilization. Not Shit! I think we've been found out, boys. Yep. That didn't work out like planned. I don't know how it wanted us to get... I guess we could have sleep darted that guy. We'll do it again. It worked out really well because we were able to double assassinate those first two. But then the, the freaking second guy, we weren't going to be able to make that. Captain Hornigold has dispatched some of his best men to ensure the sage is captured. 
What of the sage's prison? Well, shit. <laughs> what of the sage's prison? Africa, Yaris. Africa? By God. The winds do not favor that. I concur, Grandmaster. I should have sailed there myself. One of my slave galleys would be more than capable of making a swift journey. Slave galley? Captain, I asked you to digest yourself of that secret. I failed to see the difference between enslaving some men and all men. Our aim is to steer the entire course of civilization, is it not? A body enslaved inspires the mind to revolt. But enslave a man's mind, and his body will follow naturally. A fair point, Grandmaster. Whoo! Nice. That worked out well. Remind me, where in Africa are we looking? Principe, sir, a small island. We've sent two of our best men. Burgess and Cochrane. Privateers with fast ships and fur. Well, that's cars. a funny name. Edward Kenway! Imagine my surprise at seeing your jackdaw anchored there. Have you heard all you came to hear? Will you now rescue the sage from our clutching hands? A pox on you, traitor! You sold us down river. Because I found a better path. The Templars know order. Discipline, structure. But you never could fathom these subtleties. Goodbye, old friend. You were a soldier once, when you fought for something real. Something beyond yourself. Oh no, I'll be alright. I can take these guys on. You kidding me? I guess I won't take them on. I guess I'll just run. Shit. Stop. I won't let you pass. Stop! I can get it from here! Woohoo! Agent Peterson, baby! I got a shot! I think I Y'all can't catch me! Can't catch me now! Can't catch me now! No one comes through here! <clears throat> to find a place to hide. Nice! Or not! Dang it, we almost got four four brutes there. Almost got 100% completion, that's all right. We were still very successful there. I will take that. That was a fun mission. Very, very fun, all right. Let's head back to the jack. To Whoa, now that was not necessary, was it? Do you wanna just get your ass beat right now? Is that what you were looking for? Cause I'll be happy to hand it to you. Hey now! Don't you want to Don't beat up on a pirate? Before a magistrate. Do these mercenaries help me out for free? Well shit, the pirate died anyway. We do need more crew members, man. We ordered that they're not ordered, but we um upgraded the uh the quarters, the crew quarters on the jackdaw, so we need, uh, oops, let's go over to the rowboat. We need more crew members to fill that out. 